San Bonani, Babugeli, Amakaya, Siani Bingalela, Nonke, Dumelang, Absheni. Um, see a bong and a mucha, Ogotini, Sichaini, La Futi, Gulo, Ushello, Letu, Esel Tandagakulu, a holistic, healthy living. Sing a guy, Pambili, Siatanda, Futu, Gutisibonge, O Bishop, Noman Bishop, Balai Kaya, O Gutava Sipele, Lituba, Logotisi Con, Ogotisini, Finelele, Sinifundi, Gabanzi, Gazem Pilo. Ba nam sanje ge into esizo besi kulunga yo e yio ge kanti futi i oral health singa gan ge ni enda beni ngiti mangi sisi si kumbuzani uguti you know what ba chele abantu uguti sisi kona sisi live go Facebook we are live YouTube live GNF TV sisi kona si kulunga zo e zempilo nam sanje ge sin petele u doctor ngambule also be as joiner from um, online on zoom because she is not be able ukuthi abe nathi lapha estudio kanti ke ninga mangali konke kuzohamba kahle ngohlelo so today we are talking about oral health sizongena kuwo ama slides way to abantu bayazibuza emakhaya ukuthi kanti kahle kahle i oral health Yini Ninga Mangali Namusha Sizokulumangayo. We will be showing you guys right now the visual as we're gonna be going through, you know, Nam Sanji Sin si prepare Saze San Hulela, Ngaba Sifuna Ogutini Bone Gashe Gashe Loko Esikuluma Nago. Sifuna Oguti as we we talking um si joiniwe naye u doctor ngambule so that you guys can actually see what we are talking about. Gakulu gesiza uguti ungezwa pela kantu ubon. Ngoba umo ubona uzo kumbula gashe uti ya nyas kumbula lesa stombe lesi abo togotela eba mkombi sasona so yiyo gelento enge ngaifuni singa ga moshanga neskati masinge neguyo endaba ya namshanje i oral health so um Gakulu, before we even understand, before we get into the details of e oral health, kuzomele ogoti si sho ogoti gache gache e yini e oral health. So by definition, and I'm going to read this. Ngaso isku abesi ngzo pindenge zanjani ni ngzo stolika ogoti si zisi se emakaya. Oral health is a state of being free from chronic mouth and facial pain. So um, it is when you are free from chronic chronic mouth and facial pain, oral and throat cancers, oral sores, periodontal gum diseases, tooth decay, tooth loss and other disorders that affect the oral cavity. So it is not just about um, no, it's also not having any oral diseases. It is not having any oral or throat cancers. Remember the oral cavity, but it actually, um, it extends deeper. So we're also including the throat. And we're going to continue now our slides way too. Now, we have oral health challenges. Um, thank you very much. So, according to the statistics from the World Health Organi uh, Organization, oral diseases, they pose a major health burden, not just for us, but for many countries, they affect people um, throughout their lifetime. Zikosa, e pain, e discomfort, disfigurement, and even death. And these diseases share common risk factors with major non communicable diseases. Niso, Kazafuti, Gabanzi. We also um, see Lapanoguti untreated dental caries and um, both tooth decay in permanent teeth is the most common health condition. Can you believe, Oguti? You know, Amazinho abolile in permanent teeth is the most common health condition according to the global burden of disease. Nastrobega gwe sinye slide esilande layo. We also, can we please move on to the next slide? Now, what is the importance of keeping your mouth healthy? I will get into that shortly. Firstly, the one thing is the appearance, okay? They not only make a nice smile, but they also shape your face. That is the first thing, appearance. The next thing, 
chewing, all right? So amazinyo abalulegila kakhulu uma uhlafuna ukudla, all right? So the chewing of food, meles kumbula why is chewing important? Uhlafuna ukudla is the first step ekaichesteni ukudla, all right? So you need to get the food and then melo uichuwe by that you are you you are activating um the juices, digestive juices, this, so this bacteria in your mouth, it works on it and it works on the food, it becomes smaller bits and pieces. It is now smaller bits and pieces so that the digestive juices in the stomach can work even further on the food. So it is important so that it does not cause any problems. So it is appearance, that is the first thing. The second thing is chewing. And the third thing which we will be going into, the third thing, in the slides that is important when we get into why it is important it is king your speech so amazinho asebenza are with the lips umlo yeah the lips asebenza are with the cheeks as well as ulwimi the tongue and all of these um together this is a pronounce agashe so that you you can you are able to pronounce amagama gashe. Now the importance so success is on Lulela Gwisgaba Esilande Layo the importance of preserving baby teeth. So Mutias Buza, what are we saying by baby teeth? Baby teeth is Amazinho, you know, umtan megazala akala ukmilisa, the first teeth we call those baby teeth our see permanent because they will eventually fall off so it is important to see these baby teeth and um see as a gig and and you get your baby teeth you only have 20 of those baby teeth and it is important that you actually take care of these baby teeth so the the function of these baby teeth, they are actually holders. They are, they are holders for the permanent teeth. And as your permanent teeth are ovela, they will actually take a space as the baby, either baby teeth. So if there is a problem with your baby teeth, then you will have a problem with your permanent teeth. So that is why I need us to stress this, Babugeli Emakaya. Uguti, e oral health, it isn't something ekmelo uguti si kale masesi kulile. No, it is actually something that we need to start from a very young age. Because as I mentioned, the baby teeth are the placement holders of the permanent teeth. And if the and if the baby teeth are damaged, at those placement holders, ushuktini, ushuguti, even lamazinho a azayo, which we call the permanent teeth. Anyeke abe right, anyeke akule gahle because already from Amazinho Avela Ekaleni it was a problem. So we're going to be moving on to our next slide. We lose our 20 baby teeth. I mentioned over 20 baby teeth. So what happens is you lose these teeth. Why? Because you need stronger teeth as is your last for the rest of your life. And that is the 32 permanent teeth. So if we can see on the picture that is viewed in the slide, these pictures show you have this overgrowth, you have over of Amazinho, Amanya Akule next to others, and it shouldn't be like that. You already see Oguti behind, you have new teeth growing, and that is not how it should be. Instead, the baby teeth need to be completely, they need to be loosed so that the permanent teeth can take the place, not next to. Massimo Vage, we see Landelayo is slide. Manje that you know, Uguti, Ugu lose Amazinho early. Go in kinga, ne? Go in kinga, Uguti, these baby teeth are hambe early. And the things that can cause Uguti Lamazinho lawa the baby teeth are asuke, gusese early, are things like 
Oguti amazinyo abole. That is the main thing. Engayens oguti these teeth ahambe eli. And if there is that early loss, it will create a space esikulu. Where now these permanent teeth mak melo oguti zize zingen. It will be a problem. And such that you will need a dentist to actually re replace this bigger space because now suddenly you've got a bigger space so what dentists usually do is they put in what we call a space maintainer it is also called a spacer so that you can actually keep this um, space so that it is ready for the permanent teeth to take up its place manjege babugeli Sis Yazi Ganane about baby teeth and why baby teeth is important. As we go on, please do mention Lapo and Lakega Corner. Send us your comments on Facebook. We will be opening the lines eventually. Sizo Kalubuti, Nikuma Negani Nati Corner Lapo, Masesi. And once again, while we are waiting for our guest to join us, with the next slide. So, the late loss of baby teeth. So, remember, citizeni ugluza these baby teeth early. Also, losing them late is a problem because then these permanent teeth, whilst these baby teeth Zingaga pumi. Remember, melegu pumi the baby teeth, guzo kona ugusigungene the permanent teeth. So, if this baby teeth as a pumi is cut, these permanent teeth zizo vela while ama baby teeth as a corner, and then they will call, they will cause what we call overcrowding. And when there is overcrowding, you'll get overlapping teeth, and this will cause gum diseases it will cause gum diseases it will cause tooth decay because these crowded areas of the mouth are actually hard to clean if the baby teeth anga pumi who vele the permanent teeth in tezo yenze guguti uzoba na what we call overcrowding and when you have overcrowding yobanzima ugutu wat ini lama zinyo and when it is difficult uguti lama zinyo lawa atinege you will eventually get what we call tooth decay so manje asi explain ege gabanzi uguti what is tooth decay so we'll move on to our slides now Izinyo, the tooth, it is made up of three layers. You have your animal, which is the white part, then we have what we call the dentin. It is just below the animal, in a panzigwe animal. And then you have your pulp. In your pulp, ama vessels, wako, your veins, um, na, na ma arteries, they run, they even your nerves, they run in the pulp. So man just says jazz go go tease in your linja and that's why why would you have a toothache or anything like that? Because in your pulp you do have um ama nerves, okay, and then that is where there is sensation. Alright, so nerves bring about sensation. So ge ilapoge uzoza opsungu oh munyas buza, why do you bleed? Because in this pulp layer kukona ama vessels. Now we're going to move on. To the next slide. Kukona, what we call um, streptococcus mutants, are um, but it is it, it's a bug. I see bees in a bug. Net to in Jesus, we see it's the main bug. Echala ema zinueni ne echala inside um, your teeth. And then, you know, this bag, it is trying, like, you know, Abantuana, usually they get it from their mom. Um, when you ex money exchange, like um, mucous membrane, and they So, nzo explain using the next slide, when they get on Jani, Uguti, eh, is in your basically go peg. So, remember, Uguti, you will get what is called a plaque. I see funny plaque, I see tandy plaque, a melanga go be yinto or nayo. So, what is a plaque? It is an invisible film of germs, all right? I bonagali, ama germs, and a 
ayakula ezwinye nakho ungabi uyazibuza ukuthi but um you know how how does it feel mbona njani ukuthi ngine plug you know ungayiza ngo you can actually feel it with your tongue uma ukuthi uyanyakazisa your tongue um against your teeth uze akukho smooth remember it needs to be smooth um kungudlule kahle kamnandi but if it's not like that that means you have a plug it feels fuzzy i feel it like smooth ili mulakha lishereli kamnandi over the teeth then you know that you have a plug we do not want a plug why because iqala with the plug remember you have the bug i bug ihlala ezinweni angithi and then le bug lena mawaloka akhula agqwala abamanengi lama bugs then you get le plug ne so now what happens is who this plug when you eat and we will see this in the in the following slide all right when you eat sugary foods ngishukuthini by sugary foods this could be ama sweetie it could be ama ama drink that contains sugar anything really that has sugar what usually happens is that that sugar is then converted lama bag le le ilwane nyane ezisemlomeni lama bacteria enzani akonverta lo shugela achangea lo shugela ukuthi abe yi acid and this acid is not good for your teeth it is not good in your mouth and then what happens is that idla lezinyo mawuzibuza ke abanye bathi mara yaza ngaze mhlawumbe ngaba nenkinga yamazinyo em sengi zithole sengi nomgodi kha i process ekade yaqala iqala nga a simple thing as any sugary food yi drink yi juice noma ngabe yini that has sugar if the sugar ingasungi emazinyweni what happens is that this bacteria ai change le shugela ukuthi ibe yini ibe yi acid and then this acid is then converted this acid iyokele edla izinyo uma ngale wena sebathi so so uzibona unomgodi and I remember once so unomgodi emazinyweni kwenzakalani ilapho libaphunga usakhona ukudla eh, like your gums now start bleeding then you even get gum infection ukuthi namhlanje angeke sizi singene kuwo ama diseases wawo eh, umlomo the teeth and the gums kuhlelo la le viki elilandelayo sizongena kabanzi in the diseases okwamanje sifuna ni nje ukuthi sikhaze ukuthi yini i oral health and what could go wrong and what is the importance of that so now we're going to move on to our next slide nyabona la mazinyo lawa it is not a nice teeth already you can see i plug lana le plug ive in other yellowish discoloration emazinyweni and then you can see the gums ukuthi the gums are actually avuvukile a red avuvukile and they are actually getting eaten away all right now this is what we call gum disease so kubalilekile ke babukele makhaya ukuthi sizwisise ukuthi it is not just about amazinyo it is also about the gums and what affects amazinyo can actually also iyehla ne and affect your gums uthole ama gums are red the gum shouldn't be um uh, they shouldn't be like red red and swollen that is not a good sign of healthy gums and also when you're breathing your when you're brushing your teeth they shouldn't be bleeding this is a nice is a, a nice picture of how healthy teeth should look like mara ke ngizonchazisela futhi nako lokho kabanzi this um is what a healthy healthy oral cavity looks like the teeth are fine as well as the gums we're going to be move, moving on to our next slide this is what you do not want to see awufunike kanti ke ukuthi ukubone loku the gums amoshekile the teeth amoshekile the gums are receding what we call receding that's if a uh, ayadleka phansi ne mawadleka adleka aya phansi now what can we do to avoid this omunye uyazibuza ukuthi okay okay sengikhulile sengingaka 
Sekwenze gile togote langenza ni. You can always do something about it. And the first thing, it's actually very simple. I guess it cost and mix. You avoid getting these sugary substances. Imagine, you have to pay money to get these drinks. You pay money to go and buy these sweets and chocolates. All you need to do is stop buying them. That's it. Stop buying them. Prevent these sugary substances. When you're done eating those sugary substances, always make it a habit to rinse them. Maras yazuguti, you can buy a chocolate, use moli, anguzukonu gutu tolu guti, ngaso lesos kati, uhambe, uyo rinza umlomo, emol. So that is why the best advice over manje is avoid, avoid, avoid. And what can you do instead? Eat if you need sugar. You do have foods that contain natural sugars. And this is our favorite fruits. As much as we don't want fruits, we don't want the healthy things, but actually it is the healthy things that you need. Eat your fruits. You can even eat cheeses, those kinds of foods that are actually acted on by yeast. That is good. Have your cheeses have your fruits because they contain natural sugars avoid 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 ama sweet enga neni avoid ama coke avoid ama spaletta ama cream soda bias tandingani ama raspberry avoid all of those things stick to basics basics will never never go wrong you drink your water you eat your fruits and trust me you will be good to go now i will demonstrate gubo ababugeli emakaya uguti okay we know uguti if you do not take care of your teeth and you allow these bugs what is talema zingeni zingenza nangit you eating sugar you feeding these bugs and what happens is Lama bags are chinta lo sugar la kabanga nje wenu tufa go sugar. Ama bags are mix acid. And then le acid yenza njani, ila lama zinyo wena so no mkoti ama zinyo abolile. So we do not want that. Siyazu guti, it starts with a plug. We do not want that. So I'm going to demonstrate to you how we will, how you should actually be doing the right thing in terms of taking care of your teeth. Now, with taking care of your teeth, you need the following. You need a toothbrush. So, um, this is a, 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 a toothbrush. Yes, this is a toothbrush. Wow. I'm a toothbrush. Wow. So, you need a toothbrush. And what is important with the toothbrush? It needs to be a soft toothbrush, okay? It needs to be soft. You do not want lama zinyo we toothbrush uguti akine. Why? Umangabe akinile enzani, they will actually damage your, your gums. They will hurt your gums. Remember, ama gums wako, they are soft tissue. Ne? So, aufun uguti your gums abe, um, you don't want your gums to actually be, um, you don't want to hurt them. You don't want them to bleed. So, you need a toothbrush. Important, it needs to be a soft toothbrush. Next, you need what we call dental floss. Okay, so vula quickly. So they come. I'm a dental floss. I have sugar. I'm a individual. I'm a as a in um, a little boxy like this. And so, how does a dental floss look like? I'm just quickly going to cut a strand so that we can see. Okay. So you need dental floss. Ne, this is a dental floss. I hope by I wanna ababugeli emakaya e dental floss. Alright. So ngzos bega la lazy into and I'll explain later Uguti how we're going to use each. Then you need e mouthwash. So ama wash ama mouthwash manengi ayashuga. As long as it's a mouthwash and a fluoride, you need to make sure, you know what, it must have fluoride. 
Okay, so we have everything, right? You have your toothbrush. Okay, you have your toothbrush. You have your dental floss. You have your mouthwash. Okay, and the most important thing, obviously, you call gate, ne? But we will not be using Ecolgate with the model to show you how to um, take care of Amazonia work. Now, picture this being Amazonia work. Can you see them? They're nice and clean and white and the gums are healthy. This is how we want your teeth to actually look. If you Firstly, you need to brush your teeth twice a day. Yes, in the morning you need to brush your teeth and also at night before you go to bed after having supper, of course, you need to brush your teeth. And now here's the, the thing. Every time you brush your teeth, you need to do it for a minimum of, wait for it, Two minutes. Yes. Two minutes. Uwasha amazinyo. Nothing less. It has to be two minutes. Why? Because you need the fluoride. Remember, if there's a toothpaste, you toothpaste. And then, in a fluoride, a toothpaste. If fluoride is good for your teeth, Le fluoride lena, it, it actually goes in and it cleans and it needs to be activated. And you need a minimum of two minutes to actually get all of that going. Now, the next thing is how do we brush our teeth? You take your toothbrush and we wash your So, like, so it's a left and right movement. This is wrong. Awawashi amazinyo ganj. Maragani nga katazegi nizo nkomba uguti so awashanjani. So for the purpose of this, I'm going to open our model. And we'll start with la mazinyo lawa alanga pants. So it is important to guti mawash amazinyo wako. Remember you have the outside of amazinyo. I need, so that's one. You have the top part. And then you have the inner part of amazinyo. So what does that mean? You may look to cover a zonke, laying down, lazy. Okay. So it is important that you actually wash your teeth on the one side. So we're going to start on this side. It is my left, your right. You start on the left. You go all around. And then you're going to come up. You start here as well. You go all around. And then, uzoza pezulu. All the lower parts, sorry, it was done, and then you're going to finish that, and then you need to go ngapagati, uwashegonke ngapagati. So that means, lento engzon kombisa yona, gyomelo ugutu uyenze gatatu. You need to do it three times. So, what is the correct maneuver of brushing your teeth? Well, literature says. I, I, I toothbrush yako, awi bambi ibe straight ganje. No, it needs to be at a 45 degree angle. Because remember, ufunuksusa, the, the particles and the bacteria la, la izinyo ne gam elsangana kona. So you're actually going to be doing it in circular motion, and I'm going to show you how. Ababugeli already by phone, we will get to the calls shortly. So you want to do it in circular motions. I hope ukuti niabona la pekaya. So uzo ibamba la so ukalala. Uyayenza your circular motions. Unhule uze gwenye circular motions. Uze gweli nyi zinyo. And you're going to go all around. Maufiga pambili, obviously you're going to have to change the way o, 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 o bambe your toothbrush in a corner. But because I'm demonstrating, it won't be like that. And then you're going to continue. And you're going to brush in your circular motions. Remember, you do not want uguti, the particles are Allah is in your You're going to continue and then all around until you get to the end. So at a 45 degree angle, uzo yenza small circles. You don't already go inside. You go on top and you do the same thing. Circular motions, uyawasha, all around circular motions. 
and then you go to the middle and you will then go to the end then remember that is just the one part you then need to go on the on the top part of the teeth on the top part of the teeth as long as it doesn't really matter what you do it in a circular motion or whatever any motion that works for you you will use that then we move on to the inside of the teeth so remember the inside is exactly the same as the outside the same circular motions ever since seven is inside so um i hope you're born and then circular motions so what am i trying to show you you do not brush your teeth ganji left right as gwenzi loko you do your circular and ukala on the one side or your kleta on the other side ube so ye shapanti ukale foot go that side and you go on the other side ganjalo you've made a nice circular motion so uzo kala nga pande uze on top and then ukline nga pagat now when you're done so uwasha mazinyo is the one part very important go this model we do not have a tongue nya kolo guti siyaz guti lana guvela uluimi very very important is to brush your tongue sometimes there are little particles small foods is is it um in the tongue so you also want to brush those off so you don't just brush your teeth you also brush your tongue and also important to go to seven they say in or seven they say a toothbrush and a soft so that it doesn't damage your your gums remember wash Allah is in your neck gum and corner and then also get the teeth then you rinse your teeth and important it has to be a minimum of two minutes now the next thing you use your floss you I, I, apologies you use your mouthwash so the mouthwash you use it when zani ukula ne so so washile wa kafula logo buwasha now you use a mouthwash yako e rinse to what to actually rinse your mouth and then you can also gargle um yeah it is called to gargle and kono kabanga ulwimi eh lesizulu ukuthi yino gargle but ngathemba ukuthi siyazi when upula nje ngayo ke lento nge rinse yakho now the next thing that is very very important in taking care of your oral cavity is to floss now uk flossa you need to do it once a day Keta ilanga usually it's better in the afternoon or nje ya after ilanga lakho seliphelile and you use what we call a dental floss so it's very tiny but it is important to go to seven zise kahle so what you would do is you you take out a 45 about 45 centimeters of a strand sale and then lay your string le so sizo yenza wonke amazinyo wakho so you want to have a nice grip so you actually um you you want to start and you're gonna fold your floss nicely. When the show guti like ibambege gahine itinigam nandi like you've got control of the floss. Now we're gonna go back to our model. So the important thing with flossing is lento itini lene and you do not want to force it emma zinyeni, but it has to go in between the teeth. So I'm just going to use this uh, model well these teeth in front here so what you do is i hope you will be able to see this motion you do not just slide it in that is wrong you don't want to just slide it in or to just force it in you don't want to do that but gently you're going to use a a forward backward motion so a forward backward motion uguti is a ingen we are born alana ingen agalula because you know these models have been used time and time and again but when now what you do is you take your floss and then you will use it we miss a pambili a mover pambili a mover until again masi ingen you're gonna go aside in leads in your early one and then what you do is your color pansy and you're going to do it be using this forward and backward motion ulogu uza ukupuga nayo uza forward backward ukupuka nao until ipuma and then you're gonna go back in again 
But now you want to go gules in your lele line. It's about when a forward backward of the one of the one teeth. Now uzo yenza again a forward backward of the other teeth. Ninga manga linga lezi in your lele pumayo. This is not what will be happening when you are flossing. And again you do the same thing with the other. Ngawo wonka mazinyo. Kumelu kutu wenza wonke. Uyisa pambi ili na semuva. And then we are going to see you. Eling up, how we use a foot now. Pambi lina se move. You then move on. We linge is in you. You want to put it first inside, and then you're going to do your forward, backward. Pambi lina se move. Beso we are going to le linge is in you. And then na kona wenza pambi lina se move. So you want to do this now. Wonke ama zinyo wako, and you have to do this every day. Why? Why do I need to do this? And the reason is because, yes, muscle, there are other um, food particles in between your teeth, like it should brushing and getting a corner. So if loss is or sees an logo. And then the last thing, and it is also the most important thing, is that you need to visit a dentist at least once a year. Literature says you need to be visiting your dentist every six to eight months. So it is about once or twice a year. Uhambe uyobona utogotela wamazinyo. So that they can check your teeth, clean your teeth, and check what you get into it right. So we'll get just a quick recap in your call. What is this name? I'm trying to call you. And then I turn to what we come bull and I'm trying to acquire going forward is what a legila or what you want to get a mess in your walk. How do you do that? You need to brush your teeth twice a day. And every time you get a mess in your, you need to do it for a minimum of two minutes. A minimum of two minutes. Minutes, uwasha amazinyo, that is the first thing. Secondly, ma uwasha amazinyo wako, awa washi uguti uzo yenza left, right motion, that is wrong. You want to use small circular motions, circular motions all around. And then uwasha ngapande, uwasha pezulu, uwasha nangapagati. Au kliniko na lapo, you also want to brush your tongue. Kantike futi, it is important ugutu sepe nzise ini, E mouth wash. Ugutwe nchani urinse umlomo wako. Kantige, the last thing you need to do is use e floss. And saibonike, your dental floss, you need to use that nayo once a day, every day. Aike, kantige, you also need to visit your dentist at the very least. Once a year, um, go so is kati esinga ne esesi se le si zotata a caller from at home. If you have something to say, a question that you need to ask, go yo in number yeh to zero one two zero two three zero five five nine. In number onga stola ngayo ekaya is zero one two zero two three zero five. Five nine. babugeli amakaya uguti. Get yourself a dental floss. Iba legi lega kulu kante gefuti aksi yinto etu rayo unga kona njina ugutu ito lenge price ega atle. It is a dental floss. You use it every day. And this little thing kune roll enye enye and it can last you for a very long time. The most important thing kante futi ge esteche sai kosa uguti ito brush yako you need to use it for three months and that's it three months or seven is a toothbrush after that you can't use that toothbrush any more as you can see you can get us the lines are open on zero one two zero two three zero five five nine we have a caller sanbonani ni se or you are on air Japila Ninjani. Japila Nam. Hello, Kung Teta Umbuza Kutok. Yebo Mama. Hi, Dokun Jani. Japila Ninjani. The call will be taken by myself, but you can continue. Oh, okay. Um, Gumbuza in Imin Speed Zomduana, only Minyaga, and we two and a half, Uznagel and Zani Zona. Can you? 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 Can you?
Can you please repeat it? Um, 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 Okay, she among a kulu um buzo wako. Um if she has a um mama ekaya uti the is it milk tea for mama? I'm sorry okay um dr ngambule can we please get into um the answer kulega mama dr ngambule will be addressing your question shortly okay. and your answer will be answered shortly so okay. thank you mama bye bye yeah, bo, mama. Yeah, bo. all right bye while Silinde, Dr. Ngambule, to take this call, uh, to take this question for us, um, Forti, if you have your questions, please do um, call in and tell us what you would like to know. Dr. Ngambule, it's a child two and a half years old who is um, who has started teething and um, is bottle feeding. How do you actually go about? Doctor? Can, can, you can you repeat the question again? We have a two and a half old two and a half years old baby who is teething. Yes. Yes. So yes. they have their teeth and they're also bapuza uh, ibisi um predominantly. Okay. How do you mm. take care of the those teeth At what age? Okay, okay I'm guessing okay. Mama. Okay, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. At what age can a child start brushing their teeth? Oh, Okay. Eh, bo mama, abandwana mama sese ba ngane ne. Njo ngoba uzinte ashi loguti guna mazinyo la wa abandwana niti ene. Ba puza ibisi ne bonjela orusbani geza ngebedi. So into e eh, important uguti inga ne number one. Singa enzu uguti kuma ilala. Ilale imunya ipeje ipolela. Uma kfanele ifuna umunya umele ujongo mama uvuge ushale panzi umunyi singane ngoba weda nge polela or nge bene. Ngoba kwenza galani. Uma ulalisa ingane nge polela eli nobisi. At some point angito le ingane le iakreta umunya nge polela liyawa. Bese umlomo uba dry. Epsugu imilomo yetu iba dry sina mathe angithi amathe isaliva mm -hmm. amathe lawa anceda ukuthi most of the time uma sceda ukudla aya clean so umlomo wethu so uma ingane ulalisa ngebhodlela ebusuku amathe lawa ilevel yakhona iba low so ayikwazi ukususa ke lelo lebisi lebe elihlala emazinyeni oh. so iyo leyo ngina leyo uthola ukuthi kuba nezingane eziba namazinyo abolile mase bancane so mawu mama umele umntwana makaphuze ibisi Ushale or umuni se and the exceli when they show normal ana two years, mama na two years. Ninga ba nigezi i i i i lo is scrupulous i toothpaste ni toothbrush. Tata indwa mu e clean em shope usule la em lonye na omazi noma amabi li noma amatatu usule la ma usule ganjalo when zaguti lendo le ena matela emazi ni nesli zaguti i plug i usule. And the any dog a pan the web is in a tail, it choose. It's called drinky, ne tea, a pojilin. Moba nayo is the same thing. Guba no sugar, la low sugar, la loyo, umma ishang and an alio plant, upuma la ama batir. Temba wooting pendulil in Buzoe. Say, I want a cool gotella a um pendulillo, umama. Mama Uti Utogotella, a child two years of age, you do not ask Kaliga Manju Sebenzisa Utut Brashi, see, eh, Utata Induango, Utempeje, Emanzini, Bese Uzo Sula, Gashe, eh, Amazinio.
Kandige babugeli emakaya siya bonga kakulu uguti nibe natiguyo i holistic healthy living. Sesi figile guso iskati lapoge sini valelisa siya bonga kakulu uguti nibe kona ganyi nati. Kandifuti mani sese ni mibuzo aike you can still send in your questions ngevige eliza yo because sizo besi kubega ngayo i series yo oral health. Asaka kakaiti na nangevige lande la isho besi kuluma ngayo i oral health. Sifuna ge uguti si kubege ngama diseases uguti and the So please ni, ni, ni send in your questions and this is obviously what address our foot next week na yo utogotela. Sia bonga kakulu uguti ni kangani natiguyo i holistic healthy living ninga kotwa. It is very important to take care of your health, to take care of your oral cavity. Um, Yes, I'm tempted from my producers. I'm going to take very one last call. One last call. Sizi uguti e umbugeli e kaya uti ni sanbonani yo on air. Your call has been placed on hold. Please wait. Aike e yebo mama. All right. Um, Nizotela uguti ge si 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 bamba kona kona lapo eh, because a astola ni shem astola ni ngesi si abonga kakulu uguti once again this joine we had u Dr Kambule and she will also um, be joining us next week. We'll also be having u Dr Mabocha na yege futi uzo ba as joina si sakulu mangayo i oral health ninga kotla uguti your health is your responsibility. Don't forget to sanitize. Put on your mask and keep a safe distance. Si abonga. And the world is well among us, but the world did not recognize him. And the Bible says he came to his 